So my name is Diana Taylor, and I've been in the GSO for this will be this is my sixth year in the GSO. I joined in fall 2006 as a second violin, and then I switched to the chorus a few years ago, and now I sing soprano in the chorus. It was a video game orchestra. I was um, I was looking through the the listing of the student groups on STARS and I said, Gamer Symphony Orchestra thing. I said, wow, that sounds really cool. So then I sent in an email and got in contact with the founder of the GSO and joined up because I, I had been in a string orchestra in high school and I wanted to figure out how to continue with it without having to go through like a professional group or one of the official groups on campus because I did feel my level was quite up to that. So this was something that I could use to keep my music practice up and also it was interesting. I think um, the, the chorus, at least it feels a lot more social than the orchestra. It might just be because, because of the size of it. But also like our rehearsals are a lot more informal. The orchestra, there is some time to socialize with in between, like in breaks and rehearsals and dinners and stuff afterwards, but it's a lot more of a rigid business because of the stuff you need to cover and the size of the group. The way they're run is more or less the same, you know, as far as like practicing music, except for the fact that the chorus needs to be taught each of the parts. As far as the overall, I prefer the chorus just because of the general atmosphere of it. In general, we don't have to be too rigid about how we do things. We usually try to change until we run rehearsals depending on what we need to do. So it's always something a little bit different. And I think that is really important because I think if I hadn't been in the GSO, I'm not sure I would have continued with any kind of musical group at all. And I really enjoy having that in my life, so it was a good thing for me. At least as far as being in the chorus, it's improved my musical level a lot because I've never been in a formal singing group before. So being able to practice in a semi-structured environment, have people to help me and give feedback, has helped me improve a lot because I, before being in GSI, I never would have thought I would have done, you know, singing a solo in front of a thousand people. People, the people probably think that's the only reason I've stuck around as long as I have. It's really cool. It's actually, I'm glad it's happening. It's a really huge opportunity for the group that I never would have imagined when I joined six years ago. Because it was such, you know, a small little ragtag bunch back then. And I really am impressed with how the group has grown. I'm glad that the GSO has come as far as it has. I'm very impressed with it and I hope to be involved with it as much as I can in the future. I'd like to stick around in the chorus as long as there's room for me to. As long as it's not borrowing somebody else who wants to join the group. And then if not, like I'd still like to, you know, help out when the group needs like volunteers for things, anything like that. 